was Italy, a favorite to win the tournament. It was a particularly talented Italian team. As all Italian teams, they go to any tournament among the favorites to win. The general consensus was that they were going to play Ireland off the pitch. Well, the Irish know that they are underdogs, but they bring with them the hope that the luck of the Irish and their spirit may carry the day. Jack told his players, get in their faces, don't give them time on the ball, don't let them build up their passing game. And you could see that from the first five minutes that this was going to happen. Well, that's a great encouraging start, and certainly the team playing, behaving as if they were among the elite, and deservedly so. I remember, like, early in the game, Paul McGrath pulling off this great save when an Italian forward broke through and looked like he was going to score. He had this sense of, my God, you know, we, we were, for once the Irish were going to be lucky. I remember from nowhere this ball coming, dropping into the midfield for Ray Houghton. And I can see it in this sort of split second in my eye. And he must be at least 30 yards out. And he sees the opportunity and he lets fly. Houghton with a shot and it's out. It just went through my head, why not? You're at the World Cup, why not just have a shot? I mean, it was set up nicely for me, and I just thought, have a go, see what happens. After only 11 minutes, what splendid, sparkling opportunism. It's really hard. The next minute, it was just like, boom, everyone was on top of me. It was just joy, the fact that we'd taken the lead against Italy. For the next 78 minutes, the Republic withstood everything Italy kicked at them. And I'm thinking, this can't last. But as the game went on, the Republic grew in strength, and the Italians didn't fancy it. Six times they've won, six times the Italians have won. The Irish think it's their time, they may be due. We had scored a goal against Italy. We were, we were holding on. We knew we were going to beat them. It was just there, and what, it had to happen. And the Irish fans were loving absolutely every moment of it. At the final whistle, we all just went crazy because this was a result nobody had a right to expect, and it was the most glorious outcome imaginable. They beat 